Toutes ces bouteilles flottent sur l'eau de la rivière. These mountains of plastic are clogging rivers in Kinshasa, the capital of the Democratic Republic of Congo. Our observer Wei Mulloway shared videos of the waste earlier in May. There's lots of garbage in the city because people pick up bad habits, and there's no concrete policy in place to manage the waste. All we have are hollow slogans like, make Kinshasa a clean city, or no more selling water in bags or plastic bottles in the street. The fact that there are few garbage cans and dump sites just makes the situation worse. Our observer isn't the only one to publicly denounce the plastic accumulating in Kinshasa and the lack of proper waste management. In 2017, activist Fedora Beke took videos of the huge piles of plastic floating on the Congo River. The issue dates back to the 90s, when the use of plastic packaging became more widespread in Kinshasa. Today, most plastic is banned, but not plastic bottles and they make up the majority of the 7,000 tons of waste produced each day by the city's residents. The current situation makes me angry. The first way to fix it is to make people living in Kinshasa more aware of the causes and effects of all this waste. Second, we have to demand that the government set up a real waste management policy. And third, we have to make people around the world interested in this, because plastic thrown into a river in Kinshasa will definitely end up in the oceans and likely in the stomach of a whale or a shark.